you are. Thank you so much for funding this show. We really, really appreciate it. And if you'd like to give us feedback, please send me an email. It's pmjproductionsltd at gmail.com. Uh, love to hear from you, and I hope you enjoy the show. Thank you very much.
Picture of what? You. Okay. Sweet. Oh, I've got this one I can send you of me, Emily, to me at Fort Park. I've got a parrot on my shoulder and Emily is freaking out because she hates birds. And Mika has got ice cream on her face. It is so funny. You're going to laugh so much. I'm talking about another kind of picture. Oh. Like what? You know, with you looking all fresh and sexy. Sexy? Yeah. Me, though? Yeah. What, like? In a sexy dress. Or not? Oh. Shorts? Oh, I've got these well matched shorts from New Look. They're green and they say, don't hate me because I'm sexy on the back. Babes, just send me a picture of you. Just me. Just you. Without the girls? Yeah. Or the shorts? Yeah. And no dress? No. What about the parrot though? Nothing. Just you. Naked. You get me? Oh. Well, I'm fat though. You ain't though. I am though. You ain't. Ain't I? I ain't telling you no lies, babes. I really like you. I think we could have something real special. I feel it. It's deep, girl. You're like the fittest girl in school and you're driving me crazy. I want to see you. All of you. I need to see you. Now, come on, baby girl. Take a picture. Take one for me right now and send it. Okay. No way, man. Check it. Another one for your colours webpage. It's going to be like all the colours of the pussy range. Stupid little skep. Look at her tits. They're so white. She's gagging for it. How do you do it? Easy. Girls, man, my cousin said all you've got to do is tell them they ain't fat and that they're fitter than their mates. All that kind of chat. And boom. Your cousin is a dude. I'm gonna try. <laughs> you don't think so, you jizz yourself. <laughs> How many hits on the new webpage? Almost 500. Sweet. You ain't happy with just pictures though. He wants other stuff. Like what? Like videos. Doing stuff. What kind of stuff? Oh! Nothing too heavy, you get me? You don't want it into no trouble. Just, you know. Messing. I couldn't get that for you, JC, man. <laughs> no, you ain't up to it. I am, bro. I'm honest. Come on, I'm telling you. Me and Ant will get you a video for well, sexy girl. You know what will happen if he ain't happy with it, though? And if he ain't happy, I ain't happy. You get me? Yeah, Leo, I You can trust us, JC. Gotta be good. For sure. He wants quality. But no shaky shit. Won't let you down, bro. Right, Ant? Uh, yeah. Alright, let's see what you get. Sweet. Yeah, sweet. I'm hungry, man. You got any crisps? How's your hips, Maker? It's not like I had a choice, miss. It's how the tension works, you get me? Well, when you learn to control your tongue, maybe you'll be here less frequently. Anyway, I wanted to talk to you about this. Do you know what this is? Be there. Don't be cheap. Stupid the question, no. This is Laura's history book, isn't it? No comment. And what about that? That's your handwriting, is it not? No comment. Tamika, you're at school. You're not under arrest. No comment. Tamika! What, miss? I know my rights. That's what they say. Who? On cop shows. Well, this is a school book. Just practising though. Are you really? Yeah. Practising for what? Being arrested. Why do you think you're going to be arrested? Is there something you want to talk to me about, Tamika? I ain't done nothing. I haven't done anything. Me neither. Well, if you're not guilty of anything, other than double negatives, then why do you feel the need to practise? Don't you watch the news? Black people are five times more likely to be arrested. Is that right? Yeah. Well, I wouldn't worry about that. Yet. Anyway, to make it back to the point, I'm concerned about what's been written on Laura's history book. You think I wrote something this? Well, it looks like your handwriting. I don't know. Not for sure. Told you, five times more likely. Tamika, this is serious. I didn't write that, miss. You didn't? No. Well, you'd be a rubbish detective, miss. Well, good job I'm not one then, isn't it? Yeah. Well, I'll probably get a better pension. You what, miss? A pension. You know what a pension is? 
A pension is a sum of money you get paid after you stop working. You get paid to stop working? And it's much later on when you're old. What if you're not old? You only get it when you're old. It's what you've earned through working hard all your life. What if you don't work? Well, you still get pension, but it's... Is it? It is. Sweet. It's not that simple, but... It doesn't matter about that now. We can discuss the welfare system when you're next in detention. So I doubt you'll have to wait too long. Now, about this. I told you I didn't write it, miss. Okay. Do you believe me? Yes. For real? Yes, Tamika. Good. Do you know who did? It's true, though. What is? What it says about Laura. What exactly is that? You know. I really don't, Tamika. You do, miss. You've seen her. She's a slag. Tamika! And well racist. That's a pretty big accusation to make, Tamika. In what way is she racist? She only goes with black eyes. So, that really is what it means. Yeah, what did you think? That is horrendous. Wait, miss. You mean you were gonna bitch me out for something you didn't even get? That is what I mean. Word. Do you understand this word here? Do you though? Answer the question. This is completely unacceptable. Why? Well, for a start, it's offensive to black people. I'm black. And to women. I'm a woman. You're 14. Well, I'm not offended. Well, I am. No comment. I don't think you realise how serious this is. Why, though? It's just words. Words are dangerous, Tamika. Blades are dangerous, me. Tamika! What, though? It's true, though, because she is, you get me? I don't know what the problem is. It's the truth. You should see her. Where she acts and stuff from the guy she links, she just arcs him for it. It's nasty. She is proper wogs me. <laughs> Him. What? 
The porno picture. Yeah. It's going around WhatsApp. Everyone's seen it. Oh my god. Yeah. Oh my god. What's the matter? Kim K? Yeah. And with Rose. But he said. Oh my god. I feel sick. But you sent him a porno picture. I mean, it wasn't like that, didn't you? Yeah, but. So. I, so. Why did you take your clothes off like that if you don't love it? I thought. What? I thought that he liked me. Ah. Oh. Did he tell you you were beautiful? And you could have something real special and deep? And you believed him? Why are you so dumb though? Yes. Yeah. Stupid cow. Yes. Yeah. Don't talk to me! You get me? Skit! Days, can you borrow me a fan? Me, miss. me 
do. Sex scares you? No, Daisy. I mean... Sex is something special and meaningful. But it's also something that you should only do when you're absolutely ready to be intimate with somebody that you love and trust completely. <laughs> Miss, that is so gay! Daisy, how many times we are not using that as a cuss? But everyone says it! Oh, it shouldn't, it upsets people. Do you mean that Mr Chapel? Oh, not just Because he is quite emotional. Don't be cheeky, Daisy. What, Miss? Oh, you see, I can't do or say anything right. Nobody ever tells me that I'm doing good or that I look good or anything. Everyone just bitches me out the whole time. My mum, you. No, that's not true. I feel like my mum on her stupid exercise bike. She pedals and pedals and never goes nowhere. Anywhere or anywhere. What, what about you, mum? Have you spoken to her about how you feel? She don't care. She doesn't care. No, she don't. I'm sure that's not true. Miss, you have no idea. Well, explain it to me then. I can't. You don't have kids, do you? Well, no, Daisy, I don't. See? Well, not yet, yet anyway. Why have you got a boyfriend, Miss? <laughs> well, no. I thought so. Thank you, Daisy. It's all right, Miss. Uh, you don't have to worry anyway, because you'll probably, like, marry a doctor or something. And your marriage will be perfect, and you won't split up because your husband goes to the betting shop all the time and loses all your money. Your husband will be rich, and you can be a housewife, and you can cook lasagna in your big kitchen with one of them bars with seats. And you won't need to go to Slimming World all the time, and you can pick up your kids from their posh school with their stripy jackets and their ice cream seller hats so that they don't have to get the bus. And after school, you can take them to ballet class because you can afford it, even though it ain't that expensive. And they can play piano and stuff. We don't have to work in a hole like this no more. A million times different. Thank you for the insight. You paint quite a vivid picture there, Daisy. At least I'm good at something, miss. Listen. I've been a child too, and once it's over, can't get it back. Which is why you should enjoy it for as long as possible. You think? Let me show you something, miss. Look at this. And this. And this. Check out this Facebook page. See these pics. And these. Uh, this learned you how to be a size zero in a week. Uh, this is how to get boys to sex you. This is how to fake it, and this one is how to kill yourself. Read this, Miss. You see what they wrote? You see the pictures? She's dead now. You get me? I get you. See? Yes, Daisy. Yeah. What's this? 
Jenny baby. Is it? No, fool. No. That's not what we said. So? So give me the rest. No. What do you mean, no? Buy one, get one free. What? Happy hour. Maybe for you. And there's a recession. Yeah. Because of the Polish. My dad said. But I got paid for stuff. My lashes. So? So give me the rest. No. Why not? Too expensive. What? It's cheaper than fat Katie. Yeah, but it's not as good. <laughs> that is ugly. Hard lines. Jay. Cram your river. <laughs> oh yeah. Sick video by the way. Talisa. <laughs> oh yeah, I told JC we could do it. Yeah, I am. Yeah.
not a judge. Sounds weird when you say it, miss. I know. Because you're a grown up. Good to clarify. <laughs> Emily. Yes, miss. <laughs> Can you really get pregnancy tests from the 99p shop? Free in a pack. Want me to get you some, miss? says to me, God made Adam and Eve, not Adam and Steve. What was talking about me? I, I'm Adam, but I don't even know anyone called Steve. Well, apart from Grandpa and his mate, but he died last year. When he went to his funeral and my dad yelled at me because I had 11 finger rolls and proved myself. Oh, right, yeah. Because a girl sucked me off and I didn't like it. I hated it. Does that mean I'm gay? Because it wasn't that in the films. JC, that's my mate. Actually, his name's Julius, but we can't call him that, otherwise we get battered. JC's cousin's got loads of these films with people doing all this stuff, do you get me? This one was so gross. This guy had a massive dick like that. Really, really big. It looked like an arm. And he put it into a girl's bum. And he pulled it out and he put it into another girl's mouth. And he didn't even clean it first. Not being funny, but it really put me off my what's it? And then there's this other one, this girl was with five guys. Then after she started kissing another girl, and then they started. Me. 30. But I'm going to be 14 in nine days. What do you eat for breakfast, JC? Immigrant Rice Krispies. I won't like them though. I wonder what Miss eats for breakfast. Probably toast. Do you reckon she's married? Why, you fancy her? No. Nope. Just think she's alright. We can find her on Facebook. She ain't on Facebook. Oh. Because she's a lesbian hoe. Is it? Yeah, man. How do you know? My cousin, he saw her outside Asda talking to a woman and then... What? She put her arms around her. Proper for ages. Maybe it was your sister. No. Don't you hug your sister? Not like that, you faggot. If I had a sister, I'd hug her. Especially if she was crying. I hug my girl cousin. I'm telling you, miss, she definitely likes the girls. Is it? Yeah, man. How do you know? She's always putting them. In detention. She's always putting you in detention, you just don't go. She ain't interested in me anyway. You really think she's a lesbian? For sure. My dad don't like lesbians. He says they only kiss other girls because they can't get a man. True dad. Like the ones in his magazine behind the toilet. You know what? We should film her! Yeah man, my cousin's crew would dig that. Because she probably sits on Miss Stevens' face in the staff room while Andrews fucks her from behind with a big fake dick. And then Collins comes in I and he'll just start like... too many of your cousin's films. What are you saying? You ran with me. No, I said you lost. I'm beat you. sorry. Cut the fucking blocks off. Sorry, Julius. Don't call me that. Sorry, JC. You're gonna cry? No. Don't disrespect me. Pussy. Did you like the video, bro? It's alright. Getting more hits than that sketch picture. Is it? Where's Leo? Got more homework for you. From my cuss. Oh. He wants him doing other stuff, you get me? Keep his crew interested. But I know. 
What happened to your face? Fat Derek. You're still banging your mum? Yeah. What was it this time? He was drunk. Again? He just got vexed because he found out I robbed some money. How much? 50. Quid? P. What <laughs> <laughs> a fucking scam! I'm just hungry, <laughs> man. My mum never cooks nothing for us no more now that he's there all the time. She doesn't even go to the shops except to buy cans for him. They just get wasted even in the morning. Then they shout at each other and fuck really loudly. I just wanted some pickled onion monster man. So I took some coins from the kitchen table. I didn't think he'd notice. But Mr. Patel never had any left at the shop. So I had to buy coins. Burns. Yeah, man. No. Quaver's a rank. Why are you still being a pussy? Like, so just cut him. I keep telling you, you got a blade. No. Why? You scared? Are you though? Yeah. He is fat though. Yeah. Like a whale. <laughs> yeah, really. Yeah. So fat he might sell on you. Yeah! And if I cut him, it'll be nothing but fat that comes out. <laughs> fat and that. Big fat! <laughs> hey, where are you going, sexy? Don't call me that. I'll call you what I want. Fuck off, Julius. Don't call me that. I'll call you what I want. Listen to her voice. Think she's the queen of pussy. Yeah. Stuck up, bitch. Get out of my way. Oh, what? Fuck off, faggot. I'm not a faggot. Yeah, don't call him a faggot. Yeah. You've got the right to get me. Yeah. I mean, we call him that. Yeah. Is it? What are you going to do? Knock me out with your pickled onion breath. You can't do nothing. You know what I can do? You think you're so hard, don't you? Cruising with the Muppet Show. Oh, I love the Muppets. My cuz, he can tell you some things about this girl. Yeah? Like what? Eat shit, Julius. <laughs> you don't do nothing. Don't I, baby girl? Oh, baby girl. No. True that. Just another slack. Gagging for it. <laughs> I know why you're getting vexed, baby girl. Because you don't want your crew to get bitches to see what a sore you really are. Think you're special, yeah? Think you're better than us? I know you ain't, bro. I know what you are. You get me? You're just a pussy. Always will be. Your cousin's bitch. You look rubbish. You too. What happened to your eyelashes? Ain't wearing none. Oh. Why? My eyes get stuck together when I cry. Oh. They look stupid anyway. They look better without them. Whatever. Just saying. Why are you so pale though? I ain't though. You are though. And skinny. Proper skinny. Like anorexic. You want a diet? Super drug celebrity slim seven day meal replacement. Nasty. But the strawberry flavor's alright though. Why are you doing that though? Because I'm fat though. You ain't. No. You are a skep though. A proper anorexic one though. Thanks. It ain't a good thing. No. Oh. You should have asked us if you thought you were fat though. Yeah, you should have. Not him. 
We tell you the truth? Yeah, the truth, the whole truth, and nothing but the truth. Proper. You said I was beautiful. You are, sort of, for a skinny scare. Yeah, but not because he says you are. Because you just are. Thanks. At least the whole school ain't calling you a head chick. Why'd you do that, though? Just wanting to be sexy and paid. You know, like the girls in the videos? Those girls are rank, though. Yeah. Yeah. They probably don't like it, neither. Man. I missed you, bitches. Me too. Me three. <laughs> My mum is doing my head in. Tell me about it. My bro's been a tall dick. I've got well bar period pain. <laughs> hey, I like any smell me, huh? Thanks. It's Talisa's. What's it called? The female boss. I wish Cheryl had a smell. Loser. Skinny loser. Hey, do you want to go KFC after? Me? Yeah. Yeah, man. I'm starving. M? Can't. No dollar. Apart from the super drug vouchers my nan gave me for my birthday. Instead of cash. Burns. How much? Ten. Sweet. I'll sell them to you if you like. How much for? Fifteen. No. It's cool. I got some dollar. How comes? I sold my other phone to my cousin. You loved your other phone though. I've only got enough for one bucket, but we can share. Thanks. Yeah, thanks, Mika. It's cool. Gotta feed my bitches, you get me? <laughs> hey, if we go to Chicken Cottage though, we can get more pieces. Sweet. Proper food. No breasts though. <laughs> <laughs> Let's go. Hey, what about detention? Miss ain't here. Maybe she forgot? Yeah, she's well dozy. She's alright though. Yeah. Come on, detention's cancelled. Sweet. Let's look out for each other, yeah? Proper. Girl power. That is so gay. <laughs> oh, let's go back to crazy street dance class again like we used to. Yeah, man. You only stopped because you did me, huh? Yeah, all right. But listen. They can't play us like that, though. Who? The guys. They need learning. He needs learning. Proper. He messes with girls all the time. He's got to know that he can't do that. Yeah, but Mika, what are we going to do, though? Not us. Miss? Maybe. Sweet. So, where we're going to go street dance? If you don't know, they really got to get to know. We run this town. What do you get down to the ground? The boy goes there. We know they want to be with her. But we don't care. Because what they get just ain't enough. Ain't enough. It ain't enough. No, we don't care. Because what they get just ain't enough. We make the boys say, boys say, and yeah, no. We make the girls say, girls say, oh no. We make the boys say, boys say, and yeah, no. Yeah, not what? It was mental. 
He deserved it. I can't say stuff like that. Why? What's she gonna do? Beat me again? She's his sister. So harsh, man. I don't care. Why are you being a dick? Why should I care though? Because she's his blood. Yeah? What about your blood? What about Becca? What about her? You don't think they do the same to her? No way! What about his cousin? No. Becca? Or Lucy? No. Or your mum? Shut or... up! You're sick, just shut up. Don't talk about my mum like that, you fucking faggot. They're all someone's blood. So what? He don't care. It ain't him though. It's his cousin, isn't it? He's a man. That's what they do. What about us though? We never done that. We ain't sick. What about next time? What if they make us do that next time? They won't though. They might though. Then why do we do it? What? You know what? Cause? Cause what? Otherwise, we get battered. You already get battered by Fat Derek, so it don't make no difference, does it? Shut up. Game today. But I don't understand the fucking rules, do you? You can't have a game with no rules. Otherwise, the pitch is full of total cunts running around causing havoc, wanking every sod in place apart from the fucking goal. But that's it. Fuck off. No need to be rude, but I came to see how you were doing. I it. said, fuck off. And did you hear what I said? Listen, Julius, I've heard, I've heard nothing. about your sister. Who the fuck told you? That's not important. And less of the language, please. Are you okay? What do you think? I'm sorry, that was a stupid question, Julius. Yes. So fuck off and take your stupid questions with you. Well, you know where I am if you need to talk. With less of the fox. It's my fault. It's all my fault. And she didn't even look up from the TV. Too busy watching EastEnders, fucking EastEnders. Who, Julius? My mum. When the police brought my sister home, she didn't even look up. My sis. She had blood on her legs. It was so red. I puked on the carpet and then my mum, she shouted at me in front of them. She shouted at me in front of the police because I got sick on the carpet. It ain't even like she ever cleaned it anyway. What did the police say? That there were four of them? I can't remember exactly what he was saying, so I kept looking at the policeman's arms, thinking they were big, you know, and he looked strong, like a wrestler. And I felt weak and sick, real sick, and I thought if I could just be strong like him, but it was like I was going to fall over, you know? But I remember, I remember he said they had a blade. They made her do stuff. And she don't know about those things because she's a kid. Miss. She's a kid. You get me? I'm so sorry, Julie. They treated my little baby sister like some... bucket. How is she now? She won't say nothing. She just sits there and stares. It's like she's dead, miss. What about your mum? My mum's getting vexed because she keeps pissing in the bed. When the police left, you know what she said? She said that she deserved it because she went out dressed like a slack. At her age. She said she was asking for it. You know it's not your fault. It is. Well, why do you think that, Julius? She's my baby sister. Yes, and I know how you look after her. I have to. I know. You know what, Miss? The other day I went in the kitchen and my mum was proper screaming at her because she broke the kettle. She put milk in it because she wanted to make a hot chocolate. Oh. 
skunky anyway back here. But she was crying and crying so much and she just wouldn't stop. So I waited till my mum left. I took her to the shopping centre and got her a hot chocolate with marshmallows. Robbed her some chocolate buttons to you. Her face, man. I've never seen anyone so happy again. Well, wow. robbing aside, you're a good brother, Julius. I'm not, though, am I, miss? Well, why do you think that? I should have protected her. I should have protected her from... From who, Julius? From who? Boys? Which boys? Which boys, Julius? Boys like you. Yes, please. never had measles. I just got You're lying. No. You are. You are sick days. She ain't. Why didn't you tell us? Did you 
did you tell anybody? Why didn't you tell somebody? Yeah, like a grown up, because he told me not to. He said they'd kill him. He said they said I was asking for it, they always get what they want, like in their films. We've been screwed again. This is so fucked up. I know. <laughs> Thank you very much.